Hi, as it turns out, I've got a legitimate uh, electro boom style test I have to do here. I've got to, um, I suspect that I've got a faulty um, earth leakage uh, circuit breaker out in my box, which handles the rear part of the house here. We noticed overnight that, uh, well, this morning, that the power had uh, switched off to the rear part of the house and the earth leakage uh, test button on that breaker doesn't work. But we went around the house and we eliminated all of like the uh, appliances and the plug packs that are plugged into uh, this particular radial um, circuit at the back of the house. So anyway, um, we I have actually disconnected it and the breaker was actually continuously tripping. So we thought, yeah, there was something, uh, you know, one of the plug packs had got an earth leakage in it or something like that. And uh, it was, um, you know, causing a problem or something. So we switched off everything and it seems to be holding at the moment. So let's have a, let's have a go here. Let's have a read. And 244 volts, no worries. So let's actually manually try and trip this breaker. So we'll go between active and earth here with our low impedance mode, which is about uh, a 2K in there, which will go up um, as, as it heats up. So yeah, so let's actually trip this sucker. And, uh, and whoop. Okay, and let's test again. Yep. Yep, we have tripped it. Okay, successfully tripped. So there you go. Um, it did work. Well, let's go out to the box. All right, here we go. They're all uh, Hagers, and uh, if you haven't seen it, I'll link in my recent video where I did a complete switchboard upgrade. So now I've uh, completely standardized on these uh, Hager um, uh, switches here, which all have individual earth leakage circuit breakers. So for those overseas, um, <laughs> yes, we actually have a separate earth leakage circuit breaker built in, and that's what that uh, test button on the top there does. So um, yeah, so let's switch this back on. And we've got minimal load on there at the moment. So I think we've only got the one clock, I think, um, on. And this was tripping before. It was just constantly tripping out. But look, it's got the earth leakage test button. I press that. It don't work. But it will if I, like, press, uh, like, test this one here, for example. I test that one. It works just fine and dandy. But this one doesn't work. So I'd say, well, <laughs> that's definitely, I don't even have to guess, that is definitely faulty. So, um, yeah, I oh, wonder if they're under warranty. Don't know what the deal is there, but uh, yep, oops. Uh, if you watch the installation video, there's actually a common bus bar that goes along. Um, so one of our Hagers has come a gut, so they're supposed to be a, a top brand. But um, yeah, now I've got to, I guess, go along and test them all. The only one that doesn't have an earth leakage circuit breaker, by the way, is the um, Solar Analytics one over here. I'm not sure uh, why uh, they installed one for the Solar Analytics. I never had that before, but um, yeah, it's it's literally just powering that. <laughs> That's all it's powering, but okay, cool. It just means you can conveniently uh, turn the power off and onto it, so it's convenient, but uh, yeah. Anyway, so they didn't bother with that one. So there's actually, it looks like there's a switch there, but there's not. Um, and all the others have a Earth Leakage Circuit Breaker. All right, let's test them all. I've already uh, killed everything in the house anyway. <laughs> so, yep, test, 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 test. Doesn't work. And so N6 is faulty. Boom, boom. Oh, this is kind of satisfying, actually. Well, there we go. There's the heat pump. The heat pump just uh, switched off there. Uh, I think, uh, well, oh, okay, that could be that circuit. Okay, they've just piggybacked on there. Um, oven, they're all working. Um, solar main supply um, switch, yeah, all right. <laughs> and solar inverter. So they're all working. That one, it's failed. It's come a gutter. Oh, well, there you go. Like, it still comes on, so I'll still uh, use it until such time as we can... Um, and as you saw, the earth leakage circuit breaker actually uh, is, is still working in it, but there's some residual in the internal test is not working and there's probably some detection limit threshold. But anyway, the uh, nominal like 2.2K uh, in there was enough to uh, trip that. So yeah, that's hunky dory, but there you go. It's Kamigatsa. <laughs> What's the failure rate? Count them. Catch you next time.